So you're looking at a plant with grass-like or wide leaves and parallel venation. At this point you know it's a monocot and not a graminoid. How do you know if you're looking at an orchid or not? It's all about the flowers. When it comes down to it, orchids have very unusual flowers. Orchids are entomophilous, which is really just a fancy way of saying that orchids are insect pollinated. And this is obvious when you know what to look for in the flowers. Simply put, insect pollinated flowers are showy, while wind pollinated flowers have no need to be showy. When it comes down to it, the wind doesn't have any eyes. Pay particular attention to the lip or labellum in the orchids. This is a modified petal, usually but not always situated on the bottom of the orchid flower. Another characteristic to look out for are the pollinia, which are waxy pollen grains within a unit. These range from easy to spot, as in the lady slippers, to much less obvious, as in many of the other orchids. Orchids all have an inferior ovary, meaning that the ovary is situated below the rest of the floral parts. The flowers are bilaterally symmetrical. Basically, if you were to cut the flower in half longitudinally, you could then fold one half onto the other and they would match up perfectly. If you spot an orchid in fruit and you get a chance to take a look at the seeds, you'll notice they're minute, almost dust-like in appearance.